the first question for this relating to views is which views in Westminster do you consider to be most significant and why? I mean, I think there are an awful lot of significant views within Westminster. So perhaps if we could change the focus of this question and if there's any particular views that people feel are not given enough weight in terms of protection um, or too much weight or, or are, are ignored or, or we haven't acknowledged, then perhaps if anyone wants to put those views forward now, if there's anything in particular you want to raise. Uh, I would just like um, to have confirmed that the views in and out of Regent's Park are to be preserved, because we do have intrusions from time to time. Sometimes when we have the developers' perspectives with the pro proposed view, it's done in summer, and it's really Regent's Park, for instance. It's very different in winter. Thank you. Um, the officers? Um, well, in terms of views from Hyde Park, within the uh, Mayor's London View Management Framework, there's one view from Hyde Park that's identified within that, so that uh, should contribute to its protection. Other ways, um, we also identify views within conservation area audits, and so... In terms of views from Regent's Park, that's not identified as one of the mayor's um, strategic or uh, designated views, but it would be something that we pick up when we do that conservation area study, looking at what views are significant, and that would be subject to consultation as well. The only other thing I would add to that is the policies that we have in terms of uh, with, relate, with respect to parks and gardens and squares at the present moment in time does acknowledge <coughs> views from within those spaces need to be taken account of and issues of tree line, etc. So those policies are there at the moment. Um... Uh, can I add um, to the... Uh, protected areas of St. James's Park. St. James's Park in particular, because it's right at the heart of uh, Westminster um, and the, the public, the historic uh, centre of Westminster. Um, and the point about uh, the views seen in winter as opposed to summer, because many of the, the uh, planning applications have the trees in full leaf and look, you can't see the building. In winter you can. And we've already had a number of <coughs> approvals which will affect uh, St. James's Park, approvals in the last 12 months. Thank you. I wonder if you would you mind just clarifying which mayor and, and which London plan? It's a bit unclear at the moment. Yeah, it's, it is a bit unclear. The, 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 um, this, the current mayor has, is at the moment um, reviewing his policy related to views and uh, a London view management framework which updates. Th there was a, a view management framework produced in, I think it was 2005, and um, that's being reviewed and updated at the moment. It's out of consultation at the moment. Um, I think uh, due, the consultation is due to end in um, September, I think, so... Um, the current mayor, um, and it is his views policy. 